and I'm the head teacher at Arc St Albans Academy. I'm incredibly grateful to Miss Francis who's organised this quick opportunity for me to speak to all of you, the parents and pupils in Year 6 at Arc Tyndall Academy. I want to speak to you about joining the secondary school at Arc St Albans Academy. I joined the secondary school here at Arc St Albans Academy one year ago. Before that, I was the head teacher of a different Arc school in central London for 10 years. So I know Arc really well, and I'm getting to know Arc Tyndall and Arc St Albans really well too. And I'm really excited about the idea of as many of the children as possible coming from Arc Tyndall in year six to start into Arc St Albans Academy in year seven. And I want to share you a little bit of information about that right now um, in the hope that, that information will be helpful to you in terms of planning for, for you and your child's next step for year seven. Um, we've had around 30 children join us from Arc Tyndall this academic year, starting with us in year seven. They've made a great start. And I want to show you a little bit more information now about what it could look like and how it could work for your child in the future. So I'm going to share some slides so we've got some information that we can both look at together. That's just about to pop up onto the screen. So the first thing to say is the year sevens that have just joined us have made a wonderful start. We're really fortunate at our school that we have a very small cohort size in year seven. We only have 120 children coming into year seven each year moving forward. So from now on, and that is much smaller than most of the secondary schools where we'd be talking about 180 or 200 or 220 children starting in year seven. So we're a small school where we can get to know all of the children and all of the families as well as possible. As I've said, there's some quick pictures here from the year sevens who started last week. They've made an excellent, excellent start. And as I said, many of them have come to us from Arc Tyndall, where you are now. So we're looking forward to welcoming year seven and the mo most exciting thing about our school is the academic success that our children go on to achieve. We're a school with year seven to 11, but a sixth form as well. So children can stay with us all the way through to their 18 years old once they start with us in year seven when they're 11 years old. And that seven year journey is really important and really exciting to us. Children leave us to go to really elite universities. That's one of the things we're most proud of. There's a picture here of Ali on the left hand side who left us last year with three A stars in his A level. And he was one of five children from last year's year 13 cohort who went on to study medicine at university. In the middle, there's a picture of Ayan. Ayan got all nines in her GCSEs last year. Nines are the kind of highest possible grade in GCSE. We were very, very proud of her. And like Ayan and, and Ali before her, Ilian on the, the right hand side, somebody else who left us at age 18 last summer to go and study law at university. The results that our children get are well above the national average. They're in the top 10% of schools in the country at GCSE, which means we're one of the top 100 schools in the country at GCSE. And we're really proud of that success that children have as they go through the school with us. And we're really proud of how closely we work with our families and how we get to know them. This summer, I met with all of the children, you can see some of them here, and all of their parents individually, one-to-one, -to, -one, to get to know them, to find out more about them, so we could plan really carefully for them to have a really successful start to secondary school. And I'll be really excited looking ahead to next summer for all of those children who are coming to join us in Year 7, having similar conversations with them and their families. This, it's a wonderful building, with wonderful facilities. It's something I'm really excited about. It was one of the most impressive buildings that I've worked in. Lots of children often want to know about the facilities and sports and so forth. And obviously we haven't been able to use them as much because of COVID in recent years, but we're excited now to be able to use the 4G AstroTurf that we have outside, a huge full size 11 aside football pitch, and then a, a kind of really state of the art sports all with rock climbing, trampolining and, and other resources and so forth. It's a really exciting building full of great facilities and, and wonderful opportunities for the children. And I really am excited about as many of those children coming to us as possible. I think it's a real opportunity to move from one art school for primary school into another art school for secondary school. The curriculums are really closely lined up. The way we teach particular topics in maths or the way we teach particular topics in science are really joined up and the teachers between the two schools will increasingly be working together. And so often we talk about children going backwards in year seven as they get used to a new style of learning or a new curriculum or new methods in some of their subjects. There's a huge opportunity for children who've been at Arc Tyndall not to have that jump back as they come into secondary school. And that really will set them up to achieve those great results that I spoke to you about a couple of moments ago. In terms of next steps, we do have an open evening next 
Tuesday at 5 p.m. and that's open to anybody who do who wants to attend. Definitely more than welcome to attend that event. But also if you'd like to have a more personal conversation or a meeting to discuss your child coming to the school or to find out more about the school, then do just email info at arcsandalbans.org and we'll arrange a time for me to either speak with you on the phone or to meet with you in person over the next few weeks. And then crucially, if Arcs and Albans is the school for you and your child for year seven, then put Arcs and Albans Academy down as your, your first preference when completing the application form. There's a, a wonderful opportunity in the sense that Arcs and Albans as an Arc school, um, the Arc Tyndall Primary School is a is what's called a, a feeder school for, for Arc Tyndall. And that means that pupils who've been at Arc Tyndall that name Arcs and Albans Academy as their first choice are almost guaranteed a place at the school with us next summer for year seven. And I think being able to join up from one art school to another, as I say, is a, is a really wonderful opportunity for the children. I really hope that you're strongly considering Arcs and Albans um, as your secondary school. And if you have any doubts or questions or worries or things you want to know more about, as I say, please do get in touch. Either come to the open evening next Tuesday or get in touch directly with us for a more personal conversation. Very, very happy to organize some, some individual tours and so forth over the next few weeks. I'm really grateful to Miss Francis and the teachers at Art Tyndall for giving me this opportunity to speak to you. And I hope to meet many more of you very, very soon. Thanks very much. <laughs>